அசோக் சார் பிரின்சிபல் காலேஜ் சிவகாசி வெல் இனாகுரேட் திஸ் இன்டர்நேஷனல் செமினார் ஆன் ரோல் ஆஃப் குட் மார்னிங் எவ்ரி ஒன் வெரி ஹாப்பி டூ சார் வெல்கம் எவ்ரி ஒன் வாலிபால் <laughs> not only that he is a man of arjuna awardi and dronacharya awardi i welcome again the honor of man today thank you very welcome much welcome mr johnson our department staff and also all the other participants in the international webinar about role of coach in modern volleyball once again all welcome thank you Oh, okay. uh, good morning one and all connected here i uh, i am welcoming sri g sridharan renowned legend of volleyball uh, he has been consistently supporting our college i thankful to dr Ajay uh, Sridharan. As far as this uh, present scenery is concerned, there is a wide gap between the amateur performance and the professional performance. So it is our duty to join the amateur persons, players, to the professional development. this uh, present scenery is hello sir so it is our duty to join our present players whenever a player is amateur to professional professional player so here in india we have been starting several kind of premier leagues pro volleyball ipl isl epl hcl and pro kabaddi these are all the competition to bridge their gap between the national and international level so in this juncture i whole heartedly will will lead you to switch over from amateur to the professional field of course avendra is a capable man though he is able to converse in all the languages of india but as far as our college is concerned we are concentrating i invite all the participants to throw questions in english and that will be better for conversing in english thank you i welcome sri ji sridharan to our college through online welcome you sir thank you thank you anand sir over to dr johnson yes now uh the students sir uh, take the classes thank you okay uh, good morning everyone uh, those who are joining with us into the ayana nada jani kmal college shivagasi physical education and health education and sports organize this online coaches seminar because i am I am G. Sridharan.
takes in in about 48 hours because it's a big chapter the coach chapter itself a very big chapter and then the modern things modern volleyball many 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 things you have to learn the coaches has to learn because as a young coaches and young physical education teachers those who are coming outside from the colleges from the institutions from the nis after studying nis coming out they have a very big knowledge and they want to convert the knowledge into the higher level to teach them higher level volleyball because why i am telling i want i am going to talk to you today many many uh, department like what is the coach what are the responsibilities of the coach philosophy of modern coaching personal characteristic of the coach coaching of volleyball and coaching skill head volleyball coach responsibilities and duties assistant coaches and duties personality development of the players how that you will make the personality development of the player as a coach bring out the dreams of the children because as a coach that is first my aim to bring out all the children into the higher level performance and motivation what are the things i am going to give you motivate the players to bring up into that top performance and then analyzing scouting other than this many many general things are there in modern volleyball because not only volleyball any sports you take the coach is very important in the modern thing because previously many many players they say that without the coaches they are come to the limelight because there was a physical director there was a physical teacher they himself they have very interesting person and knowledgeable on the sports they brought like me i came into the volleyball in 1966 when my school teacher has given me a tip to play volleyball then i started playing in the coaching side there is a plenty of top coaches mute the others please and then if at all you see that coaches level look <laughs> that i want to be a volleyball coach or i want to be a football i want i am coming out from physical education m Period or billiard, I am field. I am a doctorate, but I am a specialized sports specialized. I am a volleyball coach, so I had to learn many many things to bring the team into the higher level, the players into the higher level. Because if I am taking one player, I am a volleyball specialized. I am taking the one college. I am taking the team. The team should come into the higher level. That's what my planning. Then I should be a very good organizer. the coach cannot say that i am only a coach i can give coaching no i have to be a very good organizer organizing competition organizing coaching camp attaching with the administration people attaching with the government of india ministry of sport sport authority of india volleyball federation of india tamil nadu volleyball federation and if they say that you organize then we have to plan we have to prepare to organize that's what the coach then teacher and educator what mean by this teacher means not only giving education even coach is a teacher because he has to teach the technique correctly the tactics correctly the physical education teachers are maximum the people who are working for development of volleyball in india in around the world if at all you see in the world from the total they know what is the sport education then they are specialized in volleyball they are making the players into the higher level the coaching coaching volleyball it is not that it's a challenging and rewarding experience because coaching volleyball it is challenging it's not very easy the people say that very easy volleyball coaching yes when you start giving children you can see that how they are developing how i can teach them very good volleyball how i can teach them the movement how i can teach them the skill 
how I can teach them, they join together because it is not the individual performance. It is the six people performance, now seven people, newly introduced Libro, seven people performance. So that what happened there, we have to get that involvement, challenging task for us. For the coaches, we have very challenging task. And then when we take that, we get reward when we achieve into the higher level, when our team goes into the winning the trophies, when we, our players are going from uh, state level, from district level to state level, from state to international level, when the team, my player is performing in international level, especially if I say that some players are performing top class, they are from the village, small village, small village, like Mohan Ukrapandian or Naveen Raja Jacob or Shelton Moses or Jay Nadarajan. These are all players from the small villages they have come. How they have come? Who, who brought them? The physical education teachers brought them. And then they are given to the specialized coach. And then they build up a uh, top player. Now the coaches are getting reward because the coach who brought, the physical education teacher who brought, now you can see that many, many players are there in the Tamil Nadu. Especially in Tamil Nadu, we have number one sport is the volleyball because every nook and corner, the volleyball plays very easily. And then you can see all the colleges in Tamil Nadu, they are having very good volleyball team. Especially SRM, they are having very good academy. And then St. Joseph College, Chennai. And then JPR College, Chennai. Then we have Ayanadar College. And then we have Sri Krishna and Ratinam College in Coimbatore. <coughs> STC College in Coimbatore, many, many colleges having coaches and then team. Because when you finish the physical education and coming out, you have plenty of job to develop the volleyball in Tamil Nadu as well as in India. The coach is a professional whose job description is to improve the level of individual player that comprise the team because he's a professional. The modern volleyball coaches, those who want to become a coach, they are professional. We cannot say that like longer days, I am amateur. No, 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 nowadays, no amateur coaches are there. Everybody professional, everybody should know everything. Then only we can go forward. And then that will ultimately, the best way the coach will help the player to achieve is maximum level. Because to achieve the maximum level, we have to be professional because if i am a <coughs> not sorry not professional then i don't get anything i need everything on professional i should know what is my player's capacity what is uh, what the plan the first is the plan how i am going to make a plan to bring this player if i am taking one player in the district level then i want to bring them into the international level how much time it takes it takes minimum three years. Three years it takes. If you are working more than 1,000 hours of working training on volleyball, then you can see a normal district level player can achieve into the international level because there is a things are there. What are all the responsibilities of the volleyball coach? Volleyball coaches assist the players in developing their full potential. Yes, <coughs> because we have to assist the players to come into the higher level and then they have to work every training they have to go in their full potential. And we are the responsibilities person because the volleyball coach, the coach means responsibility man. He is the number one man in the team. After that only player because coach having plan, what I am going to do, I'm, how I am going to give a training to this player. How I'm going to make them into the higher level. And then they are responsible for training players by analyzing their performance. Because every time we needed analyzing, analyzing performance, <coughs> every day training, analyzing should be there. I should analyze what is the plan, how he has done, how this boy is doing, how the team is doing, what about my development tomorrow? What I am going to make it tomorrow? What is my plan? Every day analyzing the player performance and providing always encouragement. Why this encouragement part in professional? Professional say that very less encouragement. No, no, no. 
professional coaches also should know that how to encourage what it mean by encourage encouraging the player he can read because the goal if you have set the goal the goal everybody knows everybody should know the goal which you have put so that to read that goal every day motivation needed every day bringing the players up coaches are responsible for the guidance of the athlete till the end what happened you had to always encourage them and give a good guidance that he can reach level because without guidance without the players may play every day every day they may train but the systematic training having only the coaches the coaches when they come their role is to learn everything on systematics <coughs> because you are a professional you are learning everything and teaching them professionalism and teaching that players also in a higher level so that you can see that all the player are listening to you and getting that you are tip and that every day doing training and they are coming up the philosophy of the modern coaching nowadays respecting the rules and games every time because we have to teach the player in the new modern things what is going on simple things i can say i went to the uh, olympic qualification tournament in china okay i am from india i am head coach of the indian team but there the substitution the time out everything on cap you cannot give in a paper the paper has gone now in the modern volleyball the paper no paper there is a e scoring and then you had to make a substitution on the tap and we learned within the two days there we learned that because why i am telling it is needed for modern things because i have to be professional i should know everything and then providing all participants equal opportunity why in any cause we should not Uh, decide that this boy is good that boy is good no every boy every girl should be given a equal opportunity and then see that how they are developing because how you want it is not possible on developing because i want that today my player after 3 months they should play for state after 6 months they should play for india possible some players are very fast at improvement some players are it is low on improvement but you have to take care give equal opportunity and then make them into the higher level and slowly 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 you can see that all the boys and girls are getting good opportunity so that they can reach into the higher level maintaining dignity under all circumstances you have to maintain your dignity you can't let down you have to be always chest up always seeing with the eyes directly with the eyes speaking directly yes whether it is right or wrong you have to say clearly because its dignity should be there always in any circumstances we should not lose our dignity the starting training always in time this is a very important for the modern volleyball coaches those who are coming coaches if you say that some time you are given on the morning or evening or afternoon whatever time you are given 15 is before the coach should be there on the stadium on the ground wherever you want to start the training then only the players will say that oh my coach is always on time he start the time on training and he finish the time on timing the training because why it learn many many thing when you teach that when physical education teachers when the young coaches teach the players on timing when they join with the state team when they join with the international team or in they join go for the some club matches they will always maintain the discipline and training always have a practice outline yes because previously the coach used to come oh, come on you play volleyball okay you run you jump you hit no you plan it and then you make every time <coughs> outlining outlining in the paper you bring paper 
outline your things and what that you are going to do today. What is that you want to develop today? Are you concentrating all the skills today? Not possible. So that I had to concentrate one drill. Okay, <coughs> I am concentrating on block. Okay, when service will be there, reception will be there, attack will be there, block will be there, defense will be there, set will be there, again counterattack will be there. But session today, because I outlined my plan to make blocking training, so I had to concentrate that. I had to tell the player in new volleyball, every player should know what is the training today. What is I am going to take that? Because you should be like what we say, everything written on the paper and give to them player. They should understand that and be properly dressed, always be properly dressed. I, I am not seeing nowadays uh, without the good dress, everybody wearing very nice dress. All the volleyball coaches are very smart now, and then physical education teachers also very good. I have seen many, many, many. Why I return that? Some time back, few years back. So that I want to say that the coaches are very. Then the coach is the own best tool. You can see the many, many papers in the Google, many, many uh, journals, or many, many videos, whatever it is. The tool, best tool, is you. For things <coughs> to prepare the planning, to prepare the training, to prepare the session, to prepare everything, <coughs> that you are the own. You are the best one. Okay, take everybody knowledge, whatever the people say, keep it in your brain. And then you start your thing. You you had you are responsibility man with your team. Team attitude begins with the coach. Yes. Very important in the modern thing. Team attitude. I am good, I am perfect, I am disciplined, I am talking good. I am giving respect to everyone. The same thing, the team will also doing the same thing. If you lose temper and doing something, the same thing will come from the team also. Practice is the form to develop behavior pattern of the team. My player behavior on and off the court is very good. What mean an on and off the court? The practice form. All you can see the behavior pattern. If you are your behavior pattern on training is very good on the player, the same thing will be very good on outside also. The personal characteristic of the coaches, flexible personality, always there. Because every time we can't get everything on the modern thing. Because now. Training. But I can come online. And I can take my player and I can say to that you do it in the home. Flexible. Always I should be a flexible for, for government, for department of physical education, or the college as principal, or everybody. Everybody having many, many thoughts. I should listen to them and I should make my thing on flexible. I cannot be a rigid. Modern volleyball coaches cannot be rigid. This is 100% you note down. You cannot be a rigid. You have to be flexible for everything. From the players, from the administration, <coughs> from the state the association, from the volleyball federation of India, from the sports authority of India, from the ministry of sports, from the government of India, from the Asian volleyball confederation, uh, from the international volleyball confederation, whatever you want. More than that, we don't have that much. You should know that and you should be flexible. 
a good listening and communication skill needed. First thing is the coach needed listening capacity. If I am having more listening capacity, then my communication will be good. If I am not listening anybody's word, then it becomes a Hitler. Okay. Sometime you can be a Hitler on training, but every time you cannot be, you have to listen the problems of children, problems of players, problems of administrator, problems of everybody. And then you decide that you can communicate correctly. Win the confidence of the player. Nowadays, you need this very important because you have to win the confidence of the player. Then only you can see the player's individual improvement, development, and then team's performance going up. Otherwise, the players, okay, they are always angry because they are very heat. They are doing training. They are doing competition. They were much worried about the result. So that you have to encourage. You have to get confidence with them. Genuine interest in the program. Always show the interest towards the program. Whatever program you make, whether you make the training plan today or you make the 21 days plan or you make the three years plan, but interest, genuine interest should be there. What for you are making a, a plan? What for you are making a program? What is that <coughs> you are going to achieve? Because no, you should know that what I am going to have in the final of that. Okay, my team last year, it entered semi-final, inter-college tournament. Okay, this year I am trying to enter in the final. My plan is like that. My interest, yes, I want to win the medal. So genuine interest. I can reach semi-final. I can reach final. I can be a first. That was a good one. Strong desire to be a successful. You needed a strong desire. Yes, if I am planned, I can. I have to do it. I can do it with my player. My player is also very much strong enough. I can do what I decide. What I decide, I am successful. I should be the successful man in my life because I planned correctly. I given training correctly. My players are very good and they are doing very nicely on training and they will participate in the competition very nicely. Sometimes happens that the players are not played. The team has come down. Don't worry. It will continue all the time. Constant handling the problem. Always the many problems will come. Many, many, many problems will come when you are a coach. When you say that I am a volleyball coach, very happy. And then back to, if you see the back, there is a hundreds of problems starting, standing to touch you. But you have to make the problem into the normal. Take the problem, everything. Okay, listen, listen, listen problem. Solve the problem slowly and make the players because if you keep the problem yourself, <coughs> it is a problem for your health also. So you have to take the problem immediately. You have to discuss with the, everybody and finish the problem with easy method. And then you have to be a model on leadership. You are a model. You are a coach. For the player, you are a father. You are a parent. You are a guardian. You are a brotherhood. And you are everything for them. And you have to be a leadership. You have to stand correctly. You have to speak correctly. You have to teach correctly. And you have to train correctly. You, even sometimes what happens? Sometimes I may go for training. My training timing is correct. And then it may spoil something. Some uh, fever has come or some injuries happen. Okay. And you have to be like leadership. What you have to say? You have to encourage the player. Okay, come on. You needed the leadership. Why I am telling? The captain, only not the leader of the team. In my opinion, the head coach is the leader of the entire contingent, entire team. Because you, you know that he can speak to the administration. He can speak to the players. He can solve the problem. So everything is there. Keep them, keep the team always under your control. Why I am telling? Because the team consists of 12 players. The coaches now internationally now consist of 14 players in internationally. And then the coaches, near about six coaches are there. One head coach will be there and two assistant coaches will be there. One trainer will be there. One physio will be there.
the higher level. You have to make yourself. Every player of mine is an international player. Here, I want to say simple, simple, small things to you. I was in Italy for five years. So, in Italy, a professional player, professional playing in it, you have a match. On Saturday, you had to go to one school and you had to train. It was in 1983, 84. I went there. I learned Italian also. When I went to school, I, the headmaster asked me, Sir, what kind of training you are going to give? I said, I am a setter of national team, Indian national team. I can give a training on setter. Then he brought one paper. <coughs> I have seen in the paper. I said, what is this? He said, this program has book. Okay, you want to take setter? This is the setter program. According to this only, you can train. You can make some drills newly, whatever drills. But of uh, uh, future my Italian national team players. Please understand, because performance of individual player is very much essential, and you should know that you even you do think that that player can be one day in the national team. So that you, you should know that what is going on in the higher level, what I can teach them, how I can teach them. Because people say that plenty of equipment now in all the colleges. We need players. Plenty of players we need that. And preparation of the team, the responsibility of preparation of the team. When I became an individual player, I'm preparing, I should know that how to make my three players play, seven players, including Libro. I should prepare all the 12 players equal. My six players are going, I should prepare my team. Which team will play today? Which team is going? Everything that the coaches should need that. And result of the game. This is very much essential for the coaches. Whatever they can say very good, but they want the trophy. They want the result. They want the result. Even government of India wants the result. They know that this coach is okay. We are given the coach to the team, but they want the result. Even coaches wants to do their maximum to result. Two main questions are there. Make this coaching. What I have to do in coaching? What I can do to make the team into the higher level? How I will do it? These two things always remind. The first one is what I have to do. Mean, it simply means to analyze all activities. All activities I had to analyze. That's what I said previously. Every day training should be analyzed. Every day, the good overview of the what your task will be and what you are expecting during the coaching process. Every day program analyzing. Every day I am writing on. It's not necessary every time I should get a video analyze. Okay, national team. Every day video analyzing. State team possible video analyzing. District team not possible video analyzing. Maybe the coach can write down this I have done, this I am going to do, today's program. Yesterday I had seen that this boy is not good. Today he is coming up. Okay, coming. The second question, how I will do? This is <coughs> many, many means and methods. What are all the means and methods you are going to make? What is that you are going to make equipment on the training? What are all things you needed, means and method? You make it, then you said how you are going to make it. How will I do it? Yes. If I am having this, 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 this thing, I can do it. I am having very tall player because why I am telling uh, 10, 10 years back, 10, 12 years back, uh, we have one Sri Ram Volleyball Academy in Coimbatore. 
I, our plan was to make the good blockers in India. That was our plan. We brought many, many, many tall players into the uh, Sri Krishna College of Arts and Science. Now they are in Ratnam College of Arts and Science. Okay, these players, <coughs> when they, we brought it, they are all two meters. Especially many players nowadays also, they are playing, all are playing in Indian team, senior team. Like Vaishnav, he played, Again, he played, Dipeshina, he played, Rohit, he played, and then Ashwal Rai, he played. Everybody played into the international level. How? Because that coach, that thing, how they are, you are going to do. How will I do it? We need it. When we went there to the administrator, we asked the C66, we need it. They immediately provided because they know that these players will grow up. From the college level, they went to the international level. Junior team, Marshad played junior team, Ken Narasan played junior. So many, 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 like SRM, SRM team, many, many players are playing into the international level. How? Because the coach should know that what I have to do, how I will do it. The coaching skill, criteria for coaching skill, to master the ball perfectly in all situations. Because no, uh, we, the Coach cannot say, I have not played, I have played. Some people are there, coach, who has played volleyball. Some people are there who has not played volleyball, passion of volleyball. And then they are much interested on volleyball. And they may be fans of the volleyball, but they are interested. They want to become a coach. That is also possible in coaching. It is not necessary. All the coaches have to play for national team and come back to the coaching. No. Very difficult. Many, many physical education teachers are very good uh, professional in volleyball. I have seen many, many teachers are there. They pass the Yamphil, uh, doctor, like our Suresh Babu. He has studied with me in NIS. He was a doctor. He was a uh, physical education master. Why I am telling this? Because I learned many things from him. When I joined NIS, I learned many, many people like him, Dr. Suresh Babu. Because why I am telling, you should know that situation perfectly to all situation you have to handle the players and placement you want because <coughs> and then another thing second one to hit to serve to throw the ball very accurately safely with the right timing because sometimes we have to involve our coaching uh, coaches involve deal passing the ball for attack okay i should toss correctly I should tap the ball correctly into the modern volleyball for defense. And I had to throw the ball sometime for uh, retrieving the ball or blocking. I had to, I should demonstrate, but not possible for jumping and demonstrate or making speed and demonstrate. I can demonstrate on volleyball, hit, so throw, and the ball will accurately for the player where they want. To force the player to reach, IT, this is very essential because you had to be always back to the player. Force them to make higher quality. <coughs> if the players are hitting on zone four, okay? They are hitting in zone four slightly. No, force them. You had to go on power. You had to go on speed. You had to go on agile. You had to be jumping very high. Every time, every, every time, every individual player should get tips from the coaches. Then you can see that the rhythm, control rhythm, intensity drill will go higher. Because I have one rhythm, okay, when I am starting, if I am coming to the Ayanadar college for 15 days camp, okay, first two days, I may be a little slow because I have to set my rhythm. <coughs> After seeing the player, I make my rhythm, my intensity will be increasing and drill also will be faster. And then it goes to the higher quality because my i want my team should reach in the higher quality here coaches please listen one thing keep it in your mind whether you are teaching school or you are teaching indian senior team the training should be same the drills are same the model are same then how you are going to implement that only differs coaches should know that we cannot say that school teams are no problem. No, 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 no problem. If the school players are not good, I cannot get the Many, many national, international coaches are only polishing the players. Polishing the players. That 
development on the players or only with the physical education teachers and physical education directors and credit it goes to colleges those who are maintaining the volleyball team those who are keeping all the volleyball team it is very easy for me when they come into the indian camp i make them polish them to make them little higher little higher up to that the reaching should be from the college and the next one stop when the players are coming to the tire or the quality drops because the training goes on one hour or two hours training okay after one hour i am seeing my players are tired maybe yesterday they played competition up, up to the late night they come back they, we have training today i can see the, the rhythm of the player it's coming down or the quality of the performance is coming down because i can see that their quality they are not much involving much uh, putting uh, interest on the uh, drill so automatically we can say then we have to stop there and we have to go for other thing take advantage on your tools as a coach you need to able to use all the information tools of your advantage all the new thing what is happening in the world what is happening in asia what is happening in the senior national national junior national everything <coughs> you should know that and use all the information get the information tool to your advantage make convert into advantage because why i am telling this because if i am conducting a indian camp somebody is coming from physical education okay you watch what is going on what is the drill they are making write down you can make the same drill in your college why not why not because to take advantage if my players are playing in indian team or net the team are playing in international level club championship i will be very happy <coughs> because i have seen some of the player uh, playing very 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 difficultly in the uh, college inter college and university level i have seen that natarajan playing for university because he was in tiruchi studying st joseph college and i have seen mohan ukkar pandian studying in uh, what we say sdat with the uh, help of dakshinamurthy coach because why i am telling the coaches are made them to develop into the higher level made them training them to develop many many player like shivabalan who is a great volleyball player in india shivaraman who was a great volleyball player from tamil nadu played for india many many player previously also many players for played like vc ramalingam tm nawabjan bk viravelu or played in the university tamil nadu university has participated even in indian university captain was bk viravelu and mr anbalagan has played in indian university why i am telling if i am having very good university team very good college team then i can say my, my state junior team is good my indian junior team is good if i am having very good institution player like indian overseas bank indian bank tamil nadu electricity board tamil nadu police <coughs> and then we have uh, hindustan port of films had we have nlc like that if the institutions are good then automatically we can say that our indian senior team is good why i am telling these are all things you know information i had to get it from the everywhere whoever coach is coming giving some information collect it keep it with you for your advantage remember that the rules are the guide the player not to stop the players from developing always we should not stop the any player for development the rules the everything whatever the administration says whatever the federation says whatever the association says okay you listen but you cannot stop any player's development develop the popularity of volleyball because popularity is volleyball you all know in tamil nadu from kanyakumari to the end of this chennai the entire place where we can see the volleyball coach in the rural because one time myself and mr murugan sir you know that he was a past federation secretary great man of indian volleyball we went from the airport of tutukudi to one uh, to the uh, tutukudi we are going the airport is uh, near about tinnalveli when we went there it was evening 5:30 something a small village in the village we have seen volleyball 
playing my god they have very uh, toned net not very new net and all they have ball and very interestingly they are playing like that every village having volleyball player every having volleyball player every school having volleyball player you all know that even in the world the i yes 221 country because it is not very uh, easy i can say that um, very less players are playing no 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 we have bigger 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 volume of players are playing in the, uh, india as well as in the uh, world so that we have to popularize some more popularize some more things we are given because covid 19 has spoiled everything on our development on volleyball okay the players are in the home the coaches are in the home the physical directors <coughs> are in the home or doing work from the home but sometimes they have to make like these online courses develop their knowledge refresh their knowledge they can come up again when the choir is finishing by july august then the camp start the training start the college has opened then everybody want to work out so that you learn these things and all then you became a very good coach while determining the main goal lot of decision you have to take because when i am making a goal i have many 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 problems will come many 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 decision i have to take when i am taking decision i should make a correct decision what i want <coughs> because, because because my father used to say my father was a military man and he used to say if you want to cry cry before not after so that if you want to make decision think and take decision after taking decision you have to stick on to the decision the physiological capacities of players are very high now in modern volleyball the physiological is necessary for modern volleyball player to be able to produce lot of energy we don't have a longer time the all the matches are going to finish in one hour and 30 minutes one hour 30 minutes match is over so that we have to prepare with the speed and agile and very good jumping and all so you can see that the recovery between rally that is 8 to 58 to 10 to 15 seconds in women 15 seconds in men 8 to 10 seconds during the time out it is 13 minute 30 seconds for normal time out and 60 seconds for technical time out tto sometime internationally they use this and in between such 3 minutes all the capacity needed we have arabic and anaerobic because we start with anaerobic and we finish up aerobic so we need that both the system should be applied okay when the individual level requirement comes modern volleyball we have psychological aspects are learned more psychologically we have to prepare the players in modern volleyball inner motivational things are that focus during the game we have to tell them always because the main training the focus during helping so the most important part of the volleyball training is get better volleyball skills yes when i want to teach the volleyball i can i cannot teach it uh, more on weight training or more on endurance or more on something else no i need to teach more on volleyball skill the volleyball training session is longer exercise itself two hours training it is exercise itself is very so no extra endurance training is needed means what been day i am training my volleyball player i don't need any uh, long running like kilometer running 10 kilometer running not necessary because the endurance i can prepare with the speed endurance i can prepare with the speed with the agile with the more rally and then more uh, training giving and will go on physical training session should be implemented in training plan to prevent injury increase the vertical jump jump ability increase the velocity yes physical training some strength training i am giving <coughs> what for i want to give a strength training in volleyball it is not necessary i am not a weight lifter i am not going to give a 400 kilo of half squat and then 100 kilo of bench press what for i am not going to i am going to give to prevent the injury some ankle power shoulder power some back power some quadricep and hamstring power 
and then some stomach power. So I can make my vertical jump ability increasing because of the strength training. And then the velocity, the speed I can increase because of my strength training. And the power I can increase because my hitting shoulder arm and the serving shoulder, serving the ball with the jump and service, these are all speed. Because now modern volleyball, the strength is one time, one type, okay? The main is speed. The speed is converting into the strength. The strength converting into the speed. So if I am having efficient speed, means I have very good strength. You all know that. It things are all low in physical education because when you have want to increase the speed, you have to good in strength. If I am having good in strength, I can go very much speed. The same way, if I am having good strength on my shoulder, I can go very faster on attack. Second one, the responsibility to the head coach because everybody says coach. Up to now, I told that what are all things for the coaches, how you are to improve the things and all. Now, if you became a head coach, what is the responsibility of modern volleyball? The head volleyball coach responsibilities include informing the sport administration about the plan. Because when you became a, a, a head coach of the team, immediately you had to make a plan, a yearly plan or monthly, uh, what, that's what we say, macro plan, mezzo plan or micro plan or training session plan an hours plan, minutes plan, you have to make it. But you have to submit to the administrator. Who is the administrator? Your college principal is the administrator. Your college physical director is the administrator. Then if you are a professional coach, your state association is the administrator. And the national coach, you are the Volleyball Federation of India is the administrator. Sports Authority of India is the administrator. The sports ministry is the administrator. You have to prepare the plan first. Everything before starting of my things and all. If I have became a head coach, immediately needed is a plan. What I am going to do? He or she is accountable for behavior and performance of the volleyball team. Already I told. Coach has responsibility. I told. Here also head coach responsibility. He is the accountable for behavior of performance and the volleyball team of the team members who get trained with you because the team members coming to you are training them you are accountable behavior as well as me first one is d for discipline second one is t for training third one is p for performance DTP, if I am having in my heart, if I am writing in my heart, I, I know in my brain, DTP, always I'll be the very good coach. Disciplining performance. Like that behavior and performance of the team is I have to accountable. If anything goes wrong, I have the responsibility. I have to give a clean, what I have done, everything cleanly. So instructing the team about the various ways and means enhancing that performance many many ways are there many many ways only training not possible because i am having everything in my shop i am having one own shop i am having everything i don't know how to sell then what is the use of that shop no use like that if you are having very good team the enhancing performance many many ways are there playing competition Sending the player for other coaching camp. <coughs> bringing them some senior players for pep talk. Bringing the other coaches for training something new things what you don't know. So what happens? Your player's performance will go higher and higher because of this. So instructing the team members about the rules and regulation, policies of volleyball and teaching them how to play flexible, effectively, meaningly because Every player should know the new rules and regulations. Without knowing rules and regulations, the players cannot play volleyball in the modern volleyball. Because you cannot fight with anybody if you don't know rules. You have to know the new rules and regulations. And then, how to play flexible. You have to play flexible. It's not possible every day I can be very good. I can 
can be a very good player no one day i my performance is not coming but that day also i play with effectively and want to win the want to win always should be there into the player that the coaches should bring them the want to win curiosity they want that they want to win help coaches should help them working in collaboration with the organization office in order to select the talent players yeah work with the organization work with the colleges if i am a physical director i should work with my college uh, what we say correspondent or college principal to make the good talent player selecting the player and provide them necessary training provide them necessary training nowadays all the colleges are providing free food free accommodation in tamil nadu and free education and very good training also so that we are leading in junior leading in age level group all the age level group finals are played by tamil nadu including senior this year senior nationals we won the nationals in uh, uh, where i happened somewhere happened that we won the uh, senior nationals so possibility it happens in odisha so possibility is of that because you are providing everything you had to get the things good instructing the players on the diet and safety procedure because this is very important that diet because when you are uh, preparing the team you are building the team you are making into the competition that diet also very much needed please speak to the administrators what possible that they can give extra what possible that they can supply something uh, good things for the player okay they are giving everything good only sometime we needed extra extra we needed something to the player those who are training very hard every day for four hours you have to take them into that set competition performance criteria always make that the new modern thing you needed every time competition performance the players are to be ready for competition criteria is like that the mindset should be there the mind goal should be there on competition evaluate the players ability regularly players ability how they are performing evaluate analyze every day every day every session you analyze because you are 24 into 7 that is the work of the coaches not possible morning two hours evening okay the people say that coaches are not working coaches are working morning 3 hours evening 3 hours the entire day they are working on analyzing what is my team how they are going to do what they are going to do how that i can win establishing program evaluation execute changes based on finding <coughs> when you are making evaluation automatically you will come to know where you want to make little changes you make the changes again you make finding something you are finding good thing good okay if are coming again coming down again evaluate this is ensure the player discipline in practice section and trips because the practice section okay the training is going on you have to ensure the player discipline in the trips also when you are flying or when you are going into the other places like shivagasi to you are coming to madurai or you are going to chennai for playing you have to see that disciplined team togetherness togetherness going the team winning or losing in what the first part is discipline second part is training i have given very good training my team is disciplined the performance automatically come develop the professional relationship with the player parent and community member because if you are making a young children like school level training you are giving you have to speak to their parents also because especially on girls you have to take very much care on girls player when you are teaching them you are training them if then if you are going timing is going more than 7 o'clock in the evening you have to call the parent tell that the training is there come and take them for children because you have to take more care on them and then you should have more relationship with the community members also where you work where you stay everybody should know that you are the volleyball coach explaining to the players the importance of the teamwork and agility because shall because teamwork this is not individual individual training is different but individual can win only two place only one place point winning is service other than service if i want to win point i need player i need my my player support then only i can win a point so that the teamwork you had to 
make them always into the team travel with the student athletic and monitor teams in the competition also travel with them that's what i was telling as a coach i should travel with them and see them because younger level in the college level in the school level i should travel i am a physical director i am a coach on volleyball i travel with them okay i am staying somewhere with good one because every time it is not possible with the five star hotels and all sometimes we have to stay somewhere where the students are staying because i want to monitor that there how the team is playing in the competition promote the sportsman like always promote always say that you are a sportsman you should be very happy because sportsman uh, studies very well and then execute their performance very well and entire life will be very happiest to pass because he knows the up and down he know winning and losing both the things he knows so that he will be very happy man in his life motivating the player to perform well studies and volleyball because you know nowadays previously it is not that really okay when you are studied whatever studies you are volleyball player the respect will be there now you need a studies also minimum you need degree and then good performance so all the coaches should know that their studies also should be good so encourage them study well and then volleyball then providing them with the suggestion improve their level of studies improve their game also both the things we needed and motivating them advising the same to give their 100% they have to give every time 100% then only you can see that you are leading that you are into that top level the same thing assistant coaches are there because coaches means not only head coach we have many many assistant coach trainer and thing and here should be a professional same thing i want to say that assistant coaches also should be a professional people professional because you should understand because member of the coaching staff contribute their knowledge he should have also good knowledge about volleyball he can do the very good things how he can be he can be a loyal to the head coach to the administrator to all the people maybe he is assistant coach tomorrow if the uh, head coach goes he is the chief coach he should be open minded willing to learn always i am still learning my age is 66 i am learning now i have 55 years of my volleyball uh, life but still i am learning still many many things i am seeing new thing i am learning so you need to learn able to understand his role in the team because as an assistant coach i should know what is my role what is my duties so i should know that it play an act of professionalism establish the good communication with the head coach and players and fans because i should have good communication with the head coach with the player then with the fans also because fans also nowadays in internationally you should have more attachment with the fans also because fans want to support your team to win that so you have to say thanks to the fans also knowledge about the volleyball program what the head coach making you should know that why this is made by the head coaches what i am going to get this in the modern volleyball how i can help the players how i can help the coaches and willing to serve is always willing to serve i have to serve always my willing should be there and responsibilities of that understand the head coach philosophy because i am i am assistant coach i am having my philosophy no i have to go with the head coach philosophy because i have to help head coach and the team understand the head coach preferred technique whatever technique right or wrong the plan has made by the head coach in the modern volleyball so in the modern volleyball the head coach is whatever they say that you have to support the as assistant coach to to develop the play develop the team performance in practice assist the group of players for during drill if the drills are there if i am taking a block and he can take as a defense training so he can be a very much popular on the volleyball he should know that what is going on drills where i can help the group two three group made it. one group he can take and put in full court practice cover distance of areas of the court if i am doing full court practice and he can try to make it cover the practice and all maintain the team discipline when head coach is on gone this is easy very easy when the head coach is going for some meeting or something assistant coaches has to make the discipline and make it follow all the team's rules and regulation and discuss the practice with always with the head coach because 
whatever the head coach says to assistant coach. So this is the uh, pink what the coach. You can see that all these things you can see where the head coach is there, where the coaches are there. <clears throat> in modern volleyball, coach is in center. He has to go with National Olympic Committee. He has to go National Federation. He has to go with the National Sports Organization, a regional volleyball association, and then club volleyball department, and the National Coaches Commission, national team coach, and the other coaches, and the team management. You can see the coaching staff, team player, public relation, team performance, players relation, everything. He has to be a flexible man in the modern volleyball. I cannot say I don't know what is going on in National Olympic Committee. I should know because volleyball also part of the National Olympic Committee. I should know what is Volleyball Federation of India policy they are going to take. I should know what is Tamil Nadu Volleyball Association is going to develop, where I can help them to develop. These are all things that the coach has to do. So the coach is in the center and then everything on the side where the coaches will improve that. Personality development of the players, the player personality development, you have to develop the great impact is that when developing character, character developing on the player, it involves the coaches. Nowadays, you have to make it that character, good character for the player because fair play and honesty. These two things, you have to make them. Then only you can see that you can see the players are coming up, players are going very high performance. Sport composition, teamwork is important factor because already I told this, convincing children to play volleyball. Please convey the children why they want to play volleyball. Play volleyball, make them passionate about the great way to protect young generation from the dangerous and bad decision. Because the coach is the man is more than the father and mother because the children will listen always coach what they say. Because if the coach says, you have to walk correctly, you have to play like this, you have to study like that, and you have to go into the house and take good diet, you have to sleep at uh, 9 o'clock, you have to get up at 5.30 in the morning, you have to come for workout. So that what happens, the children are growing up very nicely and out of the bad decision and bad elements and all. They are out of that. Their timing is fully for education and sport, physical and mental. So these things should coach should take responsibility of that. Then the children will come. And another one, they bring out the dreams of the children because every children having dream, every children having dream to come up into the higher level because young people always dream something. They either mean to become the star player or simply get into the starting squad. If I am a player, I am always thinking, my coach, when he will put me in the starting six. When I am playing starting six, I, want, I am always thinking how I can be develop my team, how I can be with the national team. Because the dream, without dream, the children are not there. So we have to make the dream into success. When you make that success of the, as a coach, then the automatically, not only the name, the name, the fame, the monetary benefit, everything it will be there for the coaches. But coaches have to work now. The motivation, motivation you have to be goal setting, steps to collaborate goal setting because collaborating the setting for the goal setting, plan your own, think, listen, everything, keep it in your mind, plan your own, the winning, losing as capacity of the responsibility of the coaches. Plan to involve your player. Plan, bring them, involve them. These are all things I'm going to do. You people have to work that, then we can achieve this. Set the right climate, right, right things, you can set it. Act as a facilitator, not dictator, because always flexible, always laughing, always giving some tips, always helping to the team, always helping to the player, not as a dictator. As a dictator, you may win, but one time. You may not win continuously. And then set appropriate goal. Always set the appropriate goal in the modern volleyball. Not possible. I can say today, I can win the Olympic. I can win the world championship. Whereas I am seventh place in Asia. First thing, I have to win Asian level, Asian championship. I had to be one in three in Asian championship. So that set appropriate
135 crore people are there. Many, many volleyball players are there. But we needed something for development. We are not participating in many international tournaments. We have to participate. So many times we are writing and giving to the government. We want to go and participate competition. When you play competition, then only you can improve. Then only you come to know where you stand. Discuss strategies achieving the goal. Always discuss the strategies. The same thing I said that. Do not set impossible goal. You cannot set impossible goal. The goal should be smaller. And then every day, some small, small goal and make them achieve and bring them into the higher level. The result of the goal, the players will improve and development. And players should know that, okay, they will get a confidence because I can do this goal. I can achieve this goal. The important to implement aspect of the competitiveness. Competitiveness is very much essential now, not only in volleyball. In everywhere you can see competitiveness there. So that you have to think that how you can fight to win, will to fight, want to fight, been fighting for winning, always that. Then the coach can be, what not with aggressiveness, with the help of the, uh, with the normal thing, you can tell them. Use the good player, for example, bring the top player, like Navin Raja Jacob bringing in the uh, Shivagasi and make them one day training with them and tell them, see, this is the man who has brought uh, laurels to the India, bringing the Morgan Ukrapandian or bringing the uh, uh, Nadarajan, bringing them into the college and then tell them, bringing uh, Jerome Vinit, a top class universal now in, in India, bring them and showing to the player for making them good player example because because of that also the younger players will go into the higher level and then analyzing it is the most important subject in the uh, modern volleyball everything analyzing the study the tendencies of development of the game what is the development of the game where i am i am staying how I want to reach in a higher level how possible so everything i needed i had to go with analyzing that time frame to achieve the goal. How much the time frame? Is it three months or is it three years or 21 days camp? I want to win the inter-university championship. How many days I am having? How many days to achieve the goal? Establishment, intermediate result. Establishment, small, small result. Make some tournaments playing. Make the result on winning. Make the things are good so that your main goal will be good. And correlation between the team and their main opponent you should know that because you should know that what is opponent is doing what is your team same way analyzing as your team develops and becomes stronger the issue scouting becomes more and more important because if my team became a good became a number one then automatically next one what is the next phase so important is scouting important is analyzing once the team is reached a higher league begins to face more experienced opponent because when i reach from district level to state level i reach very tough component opponent so i had to prepare i had to analyze my concluding remarks about the modern volleyball coaching is help the player or athlete to develop sportsmanship number one number two adapting the fair play philosophy of coaching always fair play okay fight is between me and opponent and over the net, not under the net. Always I should play fair play. My philosophy is like that. Being a coach means playing many roles. You need to know, to teach, how to lead, how to organize, how to communicate, how to motivate. All the things needed in the modern volleyball. If I know volleyball very well, I, I am a coach of volleyball. I should know first thing how to teach volleyball then how to take them into the higher level and how to organize the competition or training plan or training or whatever it is, how to communicate. What are all things I am having in their thing? I should communicate to the, my players, my administrator, my department or my federation and how to motivate the player to bring them into the uh, higher level and think clear when the pressure comes. When it comes everything, think clearly what I am going to do. This was the Asian Games in 19, uh, sorry, 2018. The players performed very well. You can see 
that much only mine what is the modern coaches needed i told everything set your goal very high and don't stop till you get that that is the coach motto because my motto already i told dtp discipline training performance is my motto my motto always says that be first discipline as a coach as a player as a whatever it is second one training them training them training them give them more opportunity encourage the player encourage the children and third one automatically the performance in your hand the reward will come to the coach thank you very much thank you sir thank you ana ana or question ana solunga ana question ana venkata sir sk university from andhra pradesh how many players in south zone indra university only 12 players sir no coaching camp 3 days or 4 days how will you prepare the team they are asking only Don't, don't. that's what i told you that you should have more attachment with the administrator okay you should go to the university talk to the university physical director he should say that sir venkateshwara university where that our team is good please give me at least 15 days camp so that i can prepare because this is your individual reputation when you go and talk 100% they will give it but one thing coach your result always aim their main aim is to say that okay i can reach this you get that because within 3 days of training or not possible any training within 3 days i cannot win anything i can go and participate and come whereas 50 universities are participating along with that i am also one if i want some result sir i need some training so you have to speak to the physical directors of university and then you can talk to that some uh, sponsors are there like that also call the university players in your place where the sponsor can give food and accommodation and ground training you can train like that many many things you have to involve and you have to start thank you very much yes and another question mr devarajan from uh... which position is the hardest in a volleyball and uh, huh. another question if we we can use more than one libro in a same set uh first thing uh, which position is very harder all the position are equal <laughs> in the volleyball modern Are you play setter? Are you play libero? Are you both cannot be in the same time? Only one libero will be there. Two libros you can keep in the team. Now internationally in ABC they have fourteen members. You can take the team with fourteen members and two libero compulsory will be there. Or in India you are twelve player. If you want to take two libero you can take it. But only one libero will play inside. Two libros cannot play inside. That's the rule. thank you then uh, trichy university from ramesh dr ramesh yeah. Uh, yeah we need to polish the university team how many days uh, we have to prepare the team for university team? yeah sir if you have the if you are selected that for university because yeah. you are, you will select the team of volleyball uh, from all over the colleges okay if the, you combine the university team minimum needed 21 days of training and then if you are good good coach is there with you because tirichi we have a beautiful coaches very good coaches are there and then if they are good coach 21 days is enough to prepare the team for south zone then again come back then again you can uh, if you are qualifying for inter university then again 15 days needed minimum minimum one and a half month needed for preparing university team up to the uh, higher level thank you then uh, another question from na uh, uh, assistant coach yeah. uh, any duties and uh, assistant coach uh, uh, duties are in kekna yeah yeah many many duties are the assistant coach i already told that duties and responsibilities of the assistant coach i can send the ppt to you because i am sending the ppt to suresh babu sir and johnson sir 
you can collect it the ppt once you go through you will come to know what is the responsibility and duties of assistant coaches okay. the more than head coach assistant coaches are having more more responsibility and duties are there okay okay any question any question from johnson sir suresh babu sir ah <laughs> uh, now no na sir no sir uh, you told me 2 meters height uh, the place yeah. that we can use this uh, how can you give from the beginning sir uh, school uh, the school uh, itself or from college itself sir Training. No, from school. If the school they are studying in the tenth class or eleventh or twelfth, they are one ninety five, and then bring them into the college and make them into the training. See the uh, what we say, the height. You know, even if twenty one years, sometimes it grows. It is not necessary that uh, only in the school level he will be in two meter. No, it can be reduced. Maybe one ninety five, one ninety four. They are there when they come to the college because of training, they may grow up to two meter. it is possible but some places i have seen the 2 meter boys are there you can take to the college and give them training they will be good uh, for the national team thank you sir okay sir sir the murugan and arun shankar they have some questions sir yeah yeah please mm. what was that yeah tell me question what is the question mm -hmm. One minute. Yeah, yeah, no problem. No problem. Uh, so no, no problems. I don't know any questions, sir. Already discussed with Dr. Facebook. Yes, yes. Yeah, good morning, sir. Ah, I'm Salvo Kumar. Sir, uh, yeah. one more from chat, sir. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Sir, what are training for our students for this COVID period? COVID period is very good because if you are really yeah. want to really want to give some training to the uh, player, make in the Zoom and uh, tell them that what kind of training you can give because. i am giving to the players my top players and all uh, making them some uh, jogging in the home i am abdomen exercise some shoulder push up uh, some sit up and all and then some quarter step uh, half squat like that whatever possible in the home training and uh, except the jumps jumps i don't make it because jumps in the hard surface we don't make it we make it like flexibility more and flexibility and some strength training this also you can teach them every alternate day they can uh, make them and uh, when the everything open colleges open they will be fit enough to yes, play sir. volleyball thank you thank you very much anything suresh can i close suresh johnson sir anna uh, anbu kumaran from tamil nadu any appointment coaches from tamil nadu Anbu Many, many many coaches are appointing now. Even in Sai, they appointed many many coaches. In Tamil Nadu state government also, they are making many many coaches appointing in volleyball. Oh. And then many many even uh, colleges they are giving consulted uh, salary for the coaches they are taking if they have a very good volleyball team. So that no problem at all nowadays for coaches. Only thing enhance your knowledge and be prepared. to come as a coach and work with the teams and all thank you very much from 15 to 17 we are not performed very well in the asian championship and all so our team has gone to the 130 position in the world 
from we were 38 to 38 position now again come down to 75 position in the world because we were played a very good performance in the asian championship in 2019 and we qualified for the olympic qualification whereas the olympic qualification top 8 teams of asia participated like china japan korea iran chinese taipei uh, kazakhstan better whereas only one team has qualified for olympic is iran our per team was performed very well after that we participated in the south asian games in nepal where we beat the pakistan in the final and we won the gold medal why i am telling the south asian games winning gold medal also important because we already lost twice with the pakistan in 2019 now we we are coming up again after three years of lapse again our team is coming up uh, next asian championship sure that our team will come up again bring that uh, position in the uh, world it may be coming to 30 to 25 it will come from 75 to 25 they will bring it players are very much eager to do much good performance now thank you thank you sir uh, babu sir ana avula da avula da na avula da thank you nama we can start out okay so i can tell uh, what, first what? i am really sir uh, uh, okay yeah i'll tell that uh, thank you very much uh, my I'll, dear uh, coaches and physical directors and physical teachers those who are listening this uh, role of coach in modern volleyball through online as well as uh, in youtube i thanks to the aya nadar janaki amal college of uh, education with the physical education uh, sports department and as well as health department given me opportunity to conduct the seminar in the role of the coach please coaches note role of the coach is very 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 important for development if you are ready you have plenty of work to do thank you very much good day be safe be security and be happy thank you very much thank bye you. Uh, may, thank you. may start what up thanks sir uh, my heartfelt thanks are due to a speaker sri g sridharan arjuna awardee and dronacharya awardee for having come over here for this international webinar and give nice speech and deliberation on role of coaches in modern volleyball i take this opportunity to thank our sridharan sir to conduct many number of tournaments in our college uh, see the national volleyball tournament and other things you helped a lot in this juncture i take this opportunity i thank you sir for this wonderful opportunity and also i wholeheartedly thank our principal dr c also for having permitted us to conduct this international webinar he is a source of inspiration for our college in general and department of phys in particular thank you very much sir i take this opportunity to thank our management for having uh permit us to conduct this international webinar in our institution thank you sir my thanks are due to our staff members uh dr t suresh bob sir i think that bob sir is uh, uh, is a lucky person to study with you sir i thank dr thank suresh bob sir dr j paul i am lucky i am lucky person oh, to yes, with him <laughs> uh, dr j paul ji singh sir Dr. Y. Murugan Sir, Mr. Y. Sarun Shankar Sir, Mr. K. Meenal Chandram Sir, Mr. Shivanand Prabhu, and Mrs. K. Kavila. Thank you very much for our staff members. And also, I take this opportunity to thank Mr. P. Vengres, Assistant Professor, Department of Discom, for helping this uh, YouTube channels. And also, I thank Mr. V. Arun, Technical Assistant, for rendering their help. Uh, finally, I thank all the participants, professors, directors. director of physical education coaches lecturers students and research scholars from various uh, departments throughout india and all over india for this session you shall I move out okay sir thank you very much uh, thank you sir thank you very much sir uh, thank you sir thank you thank, thank you, you sir. very nice good that good is work. good work everyone okay sir thank you sir.